What do these five flags have in common? Crux, also known as the Southern Cross, is the most featured constellation on flags of different countries. Crux is the smallest out of the 88 designated constellations. So what makes it so special? There are over 60 different stars in the constellation of Crux, but four are commonly referred to as the Southern Cross. Now this is an asterism. An asterism is typically a small collection of stars within a bigger constellation. So this asterism, commonly known as the Southern Cross, is really kind of the important part of the bigger constellation. The Southern Cross has been used for thousands of years for navigational purposes. Following the line made by the cross, you can find yourself heading towards south. Now there are two pointer stars next to the Southern Cross, and using those two pointer stars, as well as the line made by the Southern Cross, you can really accurately pinpoint the location of the South Pole, just off by a little bit. Additionally, this constellation can be seen all year round from anywhere in the Southern Hemisphere. Those are just some of the historical and geographical reasons why the constellation has been so important. There are also lots of really interesting cultural stories about the Southern Cross. In Australian Aboriginal cosmology, the Southern Cross was interpreted to be the footprint of an emu. And its position at different times of the years could sometimes signify when it was a good time to begin collecting emu eggs, or uh, it could also mark the beginning of the rainy season. To the Maori in New Zealand, the Southern Cross was interpreted to be the anchor for a giant sky canoe. In Chile and other parts of South America, similar to Australia, the Southern Cross was interpreted to be the footprint of another flightless bird called the Rhea. And the two pointer stars next to the footprint were believed to be hunters. This theme of hunters pursuing something from the Southern Cross is also seen in South Africa, where the Southern Cross is seen as a pack of giraffes, and the two pointer stars is seen as two male lions pursuing them. Crux and the Southern Cross have had a lot of influence over many countries in the Southern Hemisphere, as seen by its depiction on so many different flags. Not only was it very culturally important to the different folk tales that were told about the constellation, but it also served a very practical purpose in terms of navigation and even used for gathering food or knowing when the different seasons were coming. If you have any stories you'd like to share about the Southern Cross, please do so in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. And if you like these kind of astronomical cultural tidbits, please follow me for more.